cozy and get a good bit in my hand. Oh my goodness, I need it this morning. It's a flipping rainy, wet day. Hello my lovelies and welcome back to my channel and another video. Today's video I'm going to be showing you 10 items which I think you guys need to know about. It's basically 10 of my current favourite items. I don't film favourites every single month purely because I'm not one of them people that goes through products very very fast. Once I like an item, I'm there, I love it, I use it to the end of its product life. It's like a mascara, I use it to the last drop and then I get a new one. If it's a hair shampoo and conditioner, I use it to the end and I get another one. Um, so I don't see the need of me filming one every single month. But I asked over on my Instagram, which is at basically a princess. Follow me over there, guys. I talk daily on there. Um, I asked over there, what would you prefer to see today? And you all said you prefer to see me film a favourites video, which was quite surprising because I thought you maybe would say a Q&A, but you want to see a favourites video, so it's coming up. So I'm going to show you 10 items which you guys need to know about. And also, I want to say, if you've just found this channel and you're thinking, who is this girl? My name's Harriet Mills, I'm 23 years old, I live on the west coast of Scotland on the Isle of Skye, and I live in my one bedroom flat with Blue. I do videos on my vlogs, my daily lifestyles, hauls, love a home bargains, love a B&M's, love a Poundland, love a Primark. Um, I'm just a normal kind of gal and if you want to see more videos from me then hit that subscribe button because it would mean the world to me and if you're a regular give it a huge thumbs up. So without further ado guys I'm going to start with my first item, it's actually not really um, an item, it's a style. So the first thing we're going to address is my hair. I have started this last two weeks of waving my hair with my GHDs, I have become obsessed with waving my hair, I literally what happened is basically I had to cancel my hair appointment and tr and do it closer into my holiday which is in four weeks time and my roots obviously I get into a point where they're not horrific but they're not amazing you know what I mean um, so I started one morning I was like I wonder how I can direct my attention from my roots and break it up because obviously when you straighten it it's just going to be like a straight thing so I just started one morning got my GHDs and I literally just like went like that and just like started crimping it sort of thing, giving it these beach waves and I flipping love it, I've become obsessed. I also think it makes somehow makes my hair look longer, which I don't know how that's possible, but I think it feel I feel like it's longer. Um so yeah, I have started beach waving, curling my hair. And like one day someone actually said to me at work, is that how it's meant to be? I'm like, yeah, I just want it kind of like messy, kind of crimped kind of look. So yeah, it might not be a thing, but I like it. So that's the first thing out of my 10 items that I literally love and if you've got your roots going through and you want a bit of like a wavy kind of look just get your straighteners and just wave your hair to the beach summer might be over but my hair is not ready for that so yeah that is my first thing that I literally have been loving this last month may I just add these items are totally random second item that I have been loving this last month is my hot water bottle if you follow me on Instagram, you will know, or you've been following me here on Ages for actually, you will know. If you've been following my videos, you will know. Lou works away. <laughs> he's been working away for all summer. He start, he got his new job in March and he's been working the whole summer. So he works week on, week off, and when he's away, not so much the end of the week, like of the end of the week he's been away, but the first like few days that he's away, it's kind of lonely. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. So what I do is I get a hot water bottle. <laughs> so sad. I don't know why I'm telling you this. And I sleep with it like on my back. Like I sleep with it behind me because I feel like it's like comforting because it's like it feels like someone's there when you wake up in the night. But obviously they're not there. But like I just like having a hot water bottle when Lou's not here because it just keeps me. It's just comforting, really. Um, so that's number two. Something I live by this last month um, is a hot water bottle, and I just find it's really soothing. And also, even if you don't have a um, partner that works away, or maybe you don't have a boyfriend or a girlfriend or whatever, you you know, hot water bottles are comforting. I recommend them. The next thing I have been loving this month is actually an app. It's called... I want to get the exact name before I actually tell you what it's called, because then obviously if I get it wrong, then that's going to be embarrassing. Um, it's called Lightroom. It's got like, it's like blue, one sec. It's just that one there. It's called Lightroom. Absolutely obsessed with it. You can take a picture and it transforms your whole picture. It's got a really good, I get asked quite a lot on my Instagram, how do you edit your photos? And that is how I edit them. I just use Lightroom. I don't really use too much on it, but like you can brighten them up. So you can take a picture that's really, really dark and Lightroom just like booms. It just makes it so, so bright and you can do like, you can make yourself more tanned. 
I know girls, yeah. You can put your saturation up and make yourself more tanned and I just really, really like it. So check out Lightroom if you want to get really good edited photos because it's very good. The fourth thing that I have been loving this month is halter neck tops. I'm wearing one today. I've just gone a bit mad on the halter neck. So this one is one that I've literally, if you look back on my videos for the last month, I think I've actually been wearing it on nearly every single video because I am obsessed with halter necks. I don't know what's going on, but I just flipping love them. So anyway, this one is one of my favorite ones. I got it from ASOS, but it's from a brand called Monkai, Monkai, Monkai. Yeah, and I got it in an extra small. It was literally less than 20 pounds. It's so cheap, but it's just really nice halter neck. So this one's one of the ones with like the straps. This is the Miss Selfridge one. But this one is one that literally goes right around your neck. It's ribbed. Ooh, it looks like it's see-through, but it's really not. It's basically just a really nice halter neck top and I just took it in with some jeans and some heels and you are ready to go out for dinner or some trainers and you are ready to go for the day but I really like it and I really just want to say guys as well sorry about the lighting today I'm literally just using my ring light because the weather is horrific outside and it's so wet like I usually quite like to have the natural light coming through behind the ring light but there's no natural light today it is dark um so yeah love a love a halter neck top that's number four on my list number five Saint Marie's tan you gotta have your sit on oh, my wait. Maybe it's the five and six, but it's just, this is the fake tan that I use. It is insane. You can put your hand in it and it actually has like, like the little thumb with it. And I just think that is such a flipping good idea. Like why you would not have a fake tan mitt with a thumb, I don't know. My mum got it me for Christmas and I was a bit like, I'm a bit funny as I said at the beginning, when I like an item, if you change the item, then I get a bit like, mm, don't like trying new things. But my mum was like, just try it, apparently it's meant to be really good. And the ones I was using before are the ones without the thumb. And then when she got me the one with the thumb, obviously I've bought another one since then, guys, I'm not just using the same fake tan mitt since Christmas. But this is really good because it's really handy because you can get into all like, the bits that you can't usually get. It's really good, that fake tan mitt. But back to the fake tan. This is my fake tan I use. It is the St. Marie's Medium Mousse. It is incredible. Now, all I can say to you girls is, it's not one of them tans that you reply and it lasts four days. It doesn't last four days. Like, I'm not gonna lie to you, but the reason I stuck with this tan is because yes, you have to apply it every time you get in the bath or a shower or whatever, because it goes too pale for me. It is so good, it doesn't streak, it comes off quite easily. Sometimes I get myself in a bit of a fake tan but where my skin gets a little bit dry and it doesn't come off as well. But it is really, really good. You just apply it after your shower and it's one of them tans if you want to go out for your dinner with your friends and you're like flipping Nora, I haven't got any tan on, it's fine. Stick it on, go out for dinner with your friends. Yes, you could wash it off the next morning, but it's just, it doesn't smell, well, Lou would say otherwise, because he hates the smell of fake tan. I don't think it smells that bad. It, it's instant, within two hours, you are glowing. Like, you put it on and it looks a bit, so if you were going on a night out with your friend, you had a couple of hours to go, you could put this on and you would go out looking fabulous. Love this tan so much. I use the medium one, it is insane. This is just the one to go for. Me and my fake tan are happy. Item number six. It looks like my hand's really tanned in this light, but it's actually not. I don't know what's going on there. Anyway, item number six that I am loving is this highlighter from Primark. Honestly, love this highlighter so much. I was, I'm not one for big makeup. I don't wear much makeup, if I'm honest with you. I don't wear foundation. Just wear powder, a bit of bronze, highlight, salted. Um, I love this foundation, that, not foundation. I love this um, highlighting powder because it is so super shiny and I find if you put it on your cheeks, it lasts the whole day and I've always got a really nice glow. It literally costs, I've got no price on it, but it was literally like two pounds, something like that. It was so cheap. It's in the color Mink Pink Highlighter and it is very good. I've got it on today actually. I don't know, you can't actually see it in this light, but it's really good. Oh, I'm right. It's really, really good and I really recommend this. So this is one of my top faves at the moment. Item number seven that I am loving at the moment is this Chanel handbag. It's not real, well, don't worry. It's not real. I picked it up in Gran Canaria about a year ago now. Yeah, a year in September it'll be, so year next month in a few days. Um, and it is just a best handbag. I know it's not real. I paid about 25 euros for it or something, but I wear it to every single dinner out and it's like literally it still looks brand new. And I think from a distance, okay, well it doesn't look real from a distance probably. I mean, if you had a real Chanel, you'd be like, nah girl, that does not look real. But for me, I feel like it looks nice and I really, really like it. I just feel like it makes an outfit look really 
I don't know, a bit more glammed up than just a usual, you know, Topshop handbag. <laughs> I really like it and I'm definitely going to be taking at least 100 euros with me this time to buy myself different fake um, goods in Spania. <laughs> I just really like it and I just feel like it's spiced up an outfit and it's just, I don't know, I just think it's a really nice well-made handbag for the price of it. I mean, who cares if it's fake? I really like that. I've forgotten if this item number seven or number eight. Anyway, another thing I'm loving at the moment. I've lost track of the numbers now. Okay, right, well, we'll just go with the flow here. Another thing I am loving, I did an eBay, uh, oh, can you see I actually have been really wearing these. I did an eBay haul, eBay, eBay designer dupes haul about a month ago now, maybe two months ago. I think it's time for to do another one soon. But I did an eBay dupes haul. In fact, it definitely is time for me to do another one soon. Do another one soon. I'm gonna be buying some stuff tonight actually for one of these videos, so keep watching. Um, I bought these these fake Gucci trainers. Honestly, at first they were a bit like too new and they did look quite fake. But the more I've worn them, I feel like, one sec, look. The more I've worn them, I feel like they look more worn and like from a distance, would you know? I'm not gonna tag them below how to find these trainers purely because every time I send someone a link, they get taken off eBay because I think they're too realistic fakes or something, so they take them off eBay, I don't know. Just type in B trainers into eBay and loads come up, like loads. And these are like 12 pounds, I mean, you just can't go wrong for that, like, I literally love them. So yeah, I think I maybe buy like a few different designs of these and maybe some other Gucci fakes off eBay and I will, I will um, definitely do another video of that in the next month, so yeah love these i think i've miscalculated my 10 favorite things that i love here because i think this is the last item i've lost track is this number nine i don't know okay the last item that i am loving at the moment is a lip balm this was in my last favorites video because purely because i literally i can't leave i can't leave the house without a flipping lip balm my lips are so like i just feel like you might not have any makeup on but if you've got a bit of lip balm on, you're looking top notch. Like I just feel like you're looking good if you've got lip balm on. So I cannot leave the house without this lip balm. I have it three in my work pocket. I have just, I just love lip balm basically. Today I've got lip gloss on, but usually I just have lip balm on all the time. Love it. And also it smells quite nice. It smells like cherries. Oh, love it. They've actually brought a watermelon one of these ones out and I like literally cannot wait to get my hands on it because this is, is it cherry? Yeah, cherry. Love this lip balm so, so much. Guys, I think I don't know how to count because I think that's nine items, but I've lost track because I've been talking too much. But yeah, that is my current favourite items at the moment. And yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, I will definitely film another one in the next, we'll say, I'm not going to do the next month because obviously, as I said to you guys, I don't love things. Um, I don't change what I like very often. But maybe we will see another one of these sort of at the end of beginning of October, mid-October, maybe I will film another one of these. Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you are new around here and if you are not, please give me a huge thumbs up and always comment because I try and reply to every single comment on my um, channel and head over to my Instagram, it's at basically princess and I will, um, I daily chat to you guys over there, I reply to nearly every message, I try and try and try to reply to every single comment and message. Um, if I don't get back to you within a week, I will get back to you, it might be two weeks, I literally spend when I get like a spare hour, I reply. And I do work full time as well, and I am super busy at work at the moment. But when I'm not on my breaks or I'm at home, I always put aside at least 20 minutes every single day to reply to messages. And because I just love chatting to you guys, so comment below. Even if I don't reply today, I will reply to you guys. Um, so yeah. Thank you. I'm talking so much about comments here. I just love chatting to you guys. But yeah, thank you so, so, for much, so, so much for watching. And I will see you all very, very soon in my next video. Thank you, guys. Bye. Bye.